Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to talk to you about my weight loss progress so far. So, I've finished my Judy and Thinkable program. I think it was like the 24th of June I finished it, might have been. It was around that week anyway. And um, so it's been like two weeks now also i was really scared to like finish the whole program because obviously like i said before the convenience of like getting your own own meals delivered to you like right to your doorstep and then just like putting it in the microwave and stuff and um yeah i was really scared about that but it's been a few weeks now it's actually i'm actually fine <laughs> definitely like helped me kickstart my healthy lifestyle i'm eating healthy still i'm working out a lot um i'm going to my uh, local gym i do quite a lot of weightlifting um at my local gym i do um basically it's an hour session it's like a coaching session so you there's two other people in the class and one personal trainer and so it's quite focused but not as like a top notch as a as a personal trainer like a one-to-one -one personal training but it's still quite good because i like i learned the proper form i learned a lot about like different lifting different types of like deadlifting um push press um squats i'm more comfortable doing it whereas before i joined this gym i was literally so scared to like do squats with barbell squats on my own and stuff so yeah so so far anyway so i've finished duty and thinkable i'm so happy that i actually did the program because otherwise it wouldn't have like kick-started my healthy lifestyle i mean I, I really think i wouldn't have gone through three months of trying to eat healthy um now that i've seen progress and how much i've lost so far which i'll tell you a bit later how much but like I probably won't be as encouraged to like eat healthy I probably would have already like started eating a load of like crappy foods and not like aware of like what I'm putting into my body and like like how much I'm actually eating because um, I remember before I did duty and thinkable I used to eat like you know those big bag of crisps crisp the shared ones used to just like literally sit and watch telly and eat that like it was just a tiny piece of like bag of chips but no i used to eat that i used to eat like loads of rice i used to eat oh my god could eat like 12 donuts in a day it was that bad <laughs> but um yeah so i finished doing unthinkable now i'm just making my own food so if anyone is interested in a video of me like on like a day where I'm going to work out, going to the gym to exercise and um, like eating healthy then let me know. I could film one of those or one of these days. So how much weight I've lost in total. So I started off with 89.7 kilograms before I did the program. I believe that's me at my heaviest um, yeah because i literally like didn't watch what i eat i just ate loads um i'm an emotional eater as well and so yeah i like gained a lot of like weight so i was really browned so puffy now after three months i'm down to 79.3 kilograms so i've lost a total of 10.4 kilograms in three months and i'm very pleased with that like I never thought I could actually like lose that much weight and still like continue with my healthy eating after the program so I'm very happy um, with my progress so far yeah and I hope you can see the difference in like my weight loss because I definitely feel the difference I feel the difference in like like just the way I feel I'm not as irritable like I don't get short of breath at rest anymore so i'm so happy with that like you don't even know i feel so much better in myself like how i look at the moment how i feel since i've lost 
quite a lot of weight I've gained more confidence um, you can see the size difference in me from when I first did my first lookbook uh, back in April I think it was and I've got a new lookbook coming out next week after the video after this um, next week so um, I'll insert a clip so there's a huge difference in my size um, so I'm very pleased with that and the confidence as well my confidence level has grown so much um, I've definitely regained my confidence back because I literally lost it and I was always miserable like I, none of the clothes fit me right I didn't quite like the way the clothes fit me and so like my confidence was really low uh, almost to a point that it affected a lot of my relationships with people like my friends and boyfriend um, because I just wasn't happy with myself so it was affecting everyone around me like I wouldn't go out with my friends because I'd be like well, I don't want to go out because I'd make up an excuse uh, or like me and my boyfriend would take photos and then I'm like I don't like that so they're like I wouldn't be happy with any of the photos taken at all and stuff like like to some people it's it's like really petty but to me it's it's quite a lot like it really affected me a lot so I've gained so much confidence since losing a lot of weight like you can see it in the next few weeks on my Instagram I've actually got like three months worth of Instagram posts planned um, already so if I could oh, if I could only show you what my feed looks like love it anyway anyway I've taken loads of photos um, when we went to London um, a week ago and I thought like wow like three months ago I wouldn't have been really happy with any of these photos but I was so pleased with how everything turned out like my new lookbook my photos that we've taken I mean I was wearing a bikini in a swimming pool and I had photos taken like come on like three months ago I would have told Jet like no you ain't taking a photo of me in my bikini so yeah since losing a lot of weight like I never thought I'd love exercise this much like I absolutely love it um like I just gained so much more confidence as well at the gym because of like because I'm I'm a member of both of like two gyms basically one local one and like one franchise one um, because the franchise one I go with my friends and the local one I just go on my own and like I got uh, my coach there and so at the local gym I just do like lifting weights on my own and like I never used to just do that I, I used to just go on the machines and stuff and now I literally like love exercise I, I love it like. I get really upset if I don't get to exercise like last week I didn't get to exercise um, as much as I wanted to and that was really upset me <laughs> but like I just feel like accomplished when I've actually done some exercise like I never thought I could actually love exercise like me who used to be so lazy like never had any time for exercise at all now I try to fit it in as much as I can so what's next okay so um, I still like I said I still don't have like a goal weight in mind but I'm hoping to lose 10 more kilos in the next three months and uh, I'll do an update then I'm not gonna do a monthly update on my weight loss because some people find that really boring <laughs> but I thought um, in three months time like end of September I I'll do an update of my weight loss um, I'm hoping to go down to 70 kilos by the end of September um, I really hope I like hit that <laughs> that mark but anyway um, so that's one of the plans um, we'll definitely be going to gym more and like lifting more and like hit my personal best that's basically the update so far guys um, I hope you liked the video and I'll see you again next time and don't forget my new lookbook is coming out next week so I'm really pleased uh, with that one. <laughs>